I've had one or two people writing in to me about their cue rotating as they play the shot. They're worried about it and asking what they can do about it. Well, let's try and have a look at this and see if I can demonstrate a couple of things that are happening. Firstly, I'll come to my cue before anybody picks me up on it. Manufacturers, well, the good manufacturers at least, will have the chevrons of an ash cue on the top and they're always in line with the nameplate of a cue. Now, before anybody picks me up on my cue, they'll notice that the chevrons and the nameplate are not in line. Over the years, the joint here, this soft brass metal, has worn away slightly, right? And the chevrons and the nameplate are not quite in line. You'll see that on some of the shots that I demonstrate. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't bother me in the slightest. Okay, so that's point one. Now we come back to the rotation, all right? Most people, again, will use the chevrons of the cue, not all, but most people, and they'll have the chevrons on the top as they play the shot. Whilst they're going backwards and forwards, they will notice very slight rotation of the cue. So if I play an imaginary shot here, the chevrons are on top. From there, I'm going backwards and forwards. I can see very marginal rotation. I play the shot, and now the chevrons are very slightly moved to the right. As long as I'm cueing in a straight line, and that's the real essence, that straight line, if I cue in a straight line, that slight rotation will not affect the shot. So here, we come here, I point the cue, the chevrons are on top, I'm going to backwards and forwards, I play the shot, stay there, and now I can see that the chevrons have moved marginally over to the right. Now, if I've got excessive rotation, one of the things that tends to happen to cause that is people, as they pull the cue back, they invert the wrist. And then when they go forward again, right from there, they come back to the normal start position. So it's, that is happening. Well, that's obviously going to cause some excessive rotation. And that may be a problem. But the other side of that, because they're doing that business and then coming back, the butt of the cue is getting flung out to the right. So that means the tip of the cue is moving to the left. You're either going to cue across the ball or apply side or both, which is obviously silly. So from there, don't worry too much if it's only slight rotation. It will not affect the shot. Thank you.